working on our relationship skills. Specifically, we're going to learn today how to be a good husband. I'm Joe Cuenco with Family Resources. What is the best way to become a good husband? Basically, you're going to have to tell your, this conversation and have it with your wife because it's really going to be particular to her personality. There may be some things that she really likes or wants that are special to her that makes her feel good as an individual. For example, she may want you to cook dinner for her one day a week. She may want you to manage all the household finances or help out with the children You know, on particular days. Give her an evening out with her friends or, or just give her some quiet time. So you really need to understand those, those interaction fundamentals that, that are really key for her. In addition, the five key attributes, dimensions of relationship, love, trust, respect, friendship, communication, all those are real key. And if you really need to understand those more deeply, then I would suggest that you attend a family resources or similar workshop, marriage education. Actually, Dr. John Gray has some good advice here. You may recall him from the Venus and Mars uh, books. Uh, very worthwhile. There are some little things that you could be doing also to help spice up the relationship. Um, are you buying your wife chocolates from time to time? Are you buying her flowers? Uh, are you sending her a text message at work? I miss you. I need you. Um, rubbing her feet. Putting gas in her car. These are all things to say, hey, I'm with you. I'm paying attention. You're the most important person in my life. I love you. But you also have to come to some agreements and compromise. For example, you know, in the bedroom. You may have to have the conversation that um, we're going to have less sex than I'm used to and probably a lot more than you're used to, but we need to come to an agreement. So it really becomes an issue of, of communicating, not compromising, but on, on agreeing how to share some of these relationship dimensions that are really important and key. You need to be prepared to give, but if you give, you ultimately will receive. There are many ways that you can be a good, a great, and perfect husband but it really needs to be something that's special and important for your wife. And you've got to talk with her about that and find out what she wants first and then execute the plan. I'm Joe Cuenco with Family Resources, Relationships for Life.